on Friday last week, President Museveni promised the National Resistance Movement caucus that he would assent to the anti-homosexuality bill amid a litany of criticism from the international community. My historical job is finished. I will sign the bill. We shall have a war with the homosexual lobby in the world, but backed by these people and you, we will go back to the world. U.S. President Barack Obama responded to Museveni's comments by warning that passing such a law would complicate the relationship between Uganda and the U.S., a major funder. On Monday, the Canadian government turned up the heat when Uganda's ambassador, Alintu Mansambu, was tasked to explain why Canada should not close the Ugandan embassy. They want to cut diplomatic ties with Uganda, and uh, Canada is taking a leading role in mobilizing the international community to isolate Uganda. The State Minister for Regional Affairs, Asmani Chinj, says the Canadian government has not yet given Uganda a formal statement regarding the contentious bill, but he says the government will not change its position. Because we are not a monarch, we are not a dictatorship, we are an elected government with a functioning parliament. So they should be able to explain to these people, just like the public in the West is agitating uh, and um, saying no to this new development, we have an equally rest, restless public insisting that this is simply not acceptable here. About 20% of the country's budget is funded by donor money. What I've heard from uh, the public and other uh, fora is that uh, Ugandans are willing to forfeit uh, the support that uh, donors are giving uh, if it means that the support is conditioned on sacrificing their values. But I'm, 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 I'm sure we are going to find a, a middle ground. Uganda's strained relationship with the international community comes at a time when Foreign Affairs Minister Sam Kutesa <laughs> is <laughs> the presidency of the United Nations General Assembly. Sudil Biaruhanga, NTV.